Well, sure, you can go out, but during these cold months, maybe you just want to spend a night in with your girlfriend. Entertaining expert, Lee Moore Suss, has some great ideas to make it fun. Hey, Lee Moore, how are you? I'm good. Happy New Year, guys. Anything with cereal, I'm good. <laughs> cereal at night, cereal in the day, cereal at midday. I love cereal. Yeah. Yes. And you have a new cereal that's, uh, you know, it's okay to have sugar cereal if you have a girl's night in. Okay, so if you have a girl's night in, what I always like to do is start with snacks, but a lot of people always think of salty snacks, so popcorn, pretzels, things like that, which you can certainly serve, but I wanted to show you guys something new that just came out. Uh, and these are from Post. They're the Post Hostess Donuts cereal and the Post Hostess Honey Bun cereal. So it gives cute. your girls' night a little bit of a nostalgic flair and it, with cereal bowl treats. And then here we have, um, so what I've done here is I just got these great containers at Party City, um, one for the donuts, one for the honey buns, and then uh, you can even see, like, they have the little, uh, they yeah, look the little, little swirls. Little, they look just... Little Cinnabons right there. <laughs> yeah. So something just a little bit different instead of popcorn if you're doing a movie night, but just something kind of fun because... So many people aren't eating like sugar cereal anymore, right? It takes you back to exactly. when you were a kid begging exactly. for it. And you can just kind of like grab it and go, and these are kind of like nice. And you'll see that kind of like in the theme, where everything's kind of mm. like small, grab and go, uh, and really just, and you can get it Those at any, really <laughs> any supermarket. It's, it's sugar in a bag. I mean, it is. But Come it's on. so, so good. So, so, so good. Is cereal right. bowl friendly treats. Okay, right. great. So now I actually like to host people at my house just so that I can make epic cheese platters. That's beautiful. So it looks like it's complicated and you, like you worked really hard, but it's, I'm actually here to tell you that it's super duper easy to put together. So a trick with cheese platters, what you want to do is you want to have at least three different kinds of cheeses. So okay. like a soft cheese, a hard cheese, a medium cheese, whatever you kind of like. And then you kind of start those as the anchor around on your plate. Okay. Uh, and then wherever you see empty space on your platter, you just fill it up with fruit, nuts, uh, some dried fruits, some crackers, then I have um, some olives in a bowl, and then I have, you could do like, uh, I have honey, but you can also do like fig jam or other jams and things like that. And these are dried figs. Dried fig, yeah. So they're I, so good. I always like regular figs on cheese platters, but they're kind of hard to find, and they're also very expensive. So these are dried figs, and then what I've oh done here God. is I just cut them in half. That's like candy. Oh, so then it goes yeah. a little bit longer. And you know what? It so, goes a little bit longer. But exactly. that's a great tip because, you know, cheese trays are great, but if you can't make them look pretty, then yeah. you feel bad. So this is, you know, basically your cheese tray your cheese is like the divider it's holding everything so it doesn't spill the loose stuff is separated by the cheese exactly so i have like the the piece of cheese the block of cheese the, the other block of cheese and then in the middle i kind of threw in all the other uh yeah. scattered what is this? pieces okay so this is tomato soup oh. so what i've done here is i actually just got tomato soup right at the i didn't make my own tomato soup i just bought it got these little mason jars and then everyone can kind of just like have one to drink so cute and right? instead of like making grilled cheese i actually bought these grilled i just bought these like cheese crackers so you can kind of like dip it and eat it that's so fantastic i love that what a cute little idea and yeah. I, what i like about these mason jars is they have the little uh handles so you definitely want to check that out. i got those at like the party so store hot. for a dollar so now this wonderful. looks like we're going to the fancy bakery at new york city but you got all of these at trader joe's <laughs> yes so what i've done here is i went to the uh uh, freezer aisle at Trader Joe's and they literally sell the macaroons just like this and they sell 12 of them and then they also have these little mini pastries. I literally just took them out of the package, put them on a nice serving tray and then it looks so fancy it and looks, so it's unbelievable. whimsical. And, Pretty. Yeah, and if you don't go to Trader Joe's you can go to like Big Y or whatever. I'm sure they have uh, a bunch of different pastry options at the freezer aisle. So now we have a bubbly bar. So what I've done here is I just got a few different kinds of juices. So I have grapefruit juice, orange juice, cranberry juice, a few different berries. So my trick here is actually not to use strawberries. And the reason is, is because then you don't have to slave away cutting up the strawberries. Exactly, right. <laughs> yes. So you just use uh, the raspberries, the blueberries, the blackberries, and then you can either already have, I mean, if you have the girls coming over, they can pour their own drinks. But this is just to kind of show you how um, it would come. And then you don't have to spend a ton of money on expensive it champagne or bubbly. So, nice so you're calling so that a Prosecco bar yeah, or a champagne prosecco bar. Or a bubbly bar, exactly. Whatever. Kava, Prosecco, whatever you kind of like. Okay. And then what I've done here is you can have your girlfriends bring different masks. So these are really fun. So I actually, uh, these are from Yes Too. You can get them right at the drugstore. This one I love because it's the super eye mask. So you kind of actually look like a superhero. It's like, it, it just, it's a fun kind of take. Thing. My daughter <laughs> loves these things. All she ever wants to be like, can we do face masks yes. together? So and sit around with your friends like you did in college exactly. and have a face mask night. Totally. And just have some fun. And if you wanted to do uh, like some photo booths and things like that, that could also be like really fun to kind of take pictures and selfies and things oh, like that. Always great ideas. I don't know where to start. What should I eat first? <laughs> Um, it's all fantastic. Save the cheese tray for me. No, I'm all just right. kidding. <laughs> for more entertaining, great entertaining ideas, check out Lee Moore's website. It's leemorloves.com.